Want to know the easiest way to make money with your already existing Shopify store? It's actually by increasing the average order total. So by increasing that average total price, you're going to be making more money per sale. And the best way to do that is actually with upsells on your site. So we're going to cover in this video what upsells are, the different types of upsells, and how to get one set up on your site today. Hi, my name is Elle McCann and I am the owner and designer of Curious Themes Web Development Studio in Nashville, Tennessee. We've been Shopify experts for over five years now and we love working with small businesses who are setting their site up on Shopify. So an upsell, as I mentioned at the beginning part of this video, is any time that you are actually adding additional items that you're recommending to people who have already shown interest in other products on your site. This is a great way to increase your average order total, which is going to, over time, as you increase that order total, of course, increase your sales. So the different types of upsells that they are, there's upsells that you can do on your site, as well as upsells that you can do after purchase. So a great example of that is one that's on your site, and this is one I highly recommend setting up. So the theory with upsells is that if someone is already interested in a product on your site or has even maybe purchased from you before, they're a lot more likely to actually purchase from you again or purchase those items that you're recommending. So an example would be on your site, if you were selling cameras, you could also, once they added a camera to their cart, you could also upsell them on an SD card or a case or batteries or anything like that that you're wanting to combine and it relates to the first product that they've added to their cart. So this way, you know, if the camera, let's say is $600, then you're able to add in additional items of an SD card, batteries that are not anywhere near as expensive as the initial price, but if they're purchasing that first camera, they might actually be interested in and wanna purchase those products. So recommending them is just a natural fit. So that's an example of an on-site upsell. You can also do upsells off the site after they've already purchased. So an example of this would be for a clothing store. So if someone has already purchased a blouse, then they're more likely to purchase from you again. If their customer experience was great, if the fit was great, then they're a lot more likely to remember that that was a great experience, enjoy the clothes and purchase from you again. So what I recommend for a post-purchase upsell would be a follow-up email. So this would be sent maybe about two, three weeks after they had first purchased from your site because that means they've probably already actually received the product, tried it on, interacted with your brand there. And so you can send them an email asking them to review the product on your site as well as recommending other blouses. So if someone, let's say, bought a blouse on your site, then you could recommend other tops that are best sellers as well. You wouldn't necessarily want to recommend something totally different like jackets or outerwear, but you want to recommend something that's very similar to what they've already purchased before from you. So that way they're more likely to purchase that type of product again from you. These are great ways to increase that order total and still be really helpful for your customers. So there are a lot of different apps in the app store with Shopify for upsell. So if you just go to the Shopify app store, which I will put a link below this video on where to link to there. But if you just go in and just search for the keyword upsell, you'll see a lot of different apps that have all these different types of functionality of either doing the upsells on the cart page, once they've added a product to their cart, instantly having that pop up. And there's even some that are post purchase. So I highly recommend you go into the Shopify app store and start checking out which upsell app might be best for you and your products. So I would love to know, are you already using upsells on your site currently to recommend other products? Or is this video really inspiring to you and you want to start adding that into your site now? Comment below this video and let me know. I would love to know what kind of industry you're in and we can even brainstorm different ways to upsell similar products to something that they've already added to their cart. 
Now, if you are still looking for more information about selling online, and maybe you've had your Shopify store for a while, but it hasn't actually been converting as well as you thought it would be, I would love for you to check out my other video called Top 3 Reasons You're Not Making Money Online, which you can see over here. So it's a great video that's dropping some truth bombs for you all about how to improve your Shopify store and your customer experience so you can increase those sales and start making money online. Thanks so much for watching this video and if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe and we post new videos every Monday through Friday all about Shopify and how to grow your online store.